Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel Tarot Dreamer. These are my new weekly readings and these are for our lovely earth signs so that's Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn um, and if you're new here um, this is a pick a card weekly reading and we have three columns so please choose a column one two or three that you feel that you're drawn to and uh, then we'll go in and read those cards for you um, and they those are our angel cards so angel message a tarot message and your fortune message for this week please do remember that these readings are a timeless reading so when you come across them is the right time for you so i'll just give you a moment to um to choose and focus on a column and uh, then we'll get into your reading okay guys and also i just want to say a quick thank you to everybody who has subscribed to my channel and that has liked the video and left comments thank you very much for that we're nearly at 300 subscribers now and uh, once we reach 777 subscribers that's our next milestone i will be launching our love and relationship in-depth tarot readings and they will be intuitive tarot readings done for all the star signs um, and like i said they'll be in-depth so they'll be longer more diving deeper into our love and relationship um, readings and they'll be done with my tarot cards for a in intuitive uh, reading every month so if you're interested in those please do subscribe it is free and uh, it does help my channel to grow also okay so let's get into your reading this is for our lovely earth signs and the first card we've got out is for the fortune card wow sudden wealth that's amazing sudden wealth so you're going to be coming into some unexpected money this this card is to do with financial abundance so there is sudden money sudden wealth coming in this week for those who chose column one and let's see what cards play with this so queen of wands queen of fire confident warm intellect intelligent and graceful so stretch your wings and fly. Don't underestimate yourself. Assert your independence and creativity. Now, the one message I want to get across with this card is do not underestimate yourself. Do not underestimate how good you are at something because it's important. You've got to believe in yourself. And this is what I always say in all of my readings. You have to believe in yourself if you want to achieve things. And this is saying to me, with the Queen of Wands, that you are coming into your own here. You're coming into your own power here. And you're finally ready to stretch your wings and fly. And this could be to do with a creative project as well. And it could be that once you believe in yourself, you're just launching into a new project. It is going to bring you some unexpected money. That you never thought was possible because maybe you didn't believe in your creative creativity that you had or in the, the, the something that you could do that you do well what it's saying is once you believe in yourself things start to change because other people will then believe in you also now the angel card that goes with that is no need to worry and there we go no need to worry don't let others get to you believe in yourself it's time to stretch your wings and fly don't underestimate what you can do because you're going to be achieving great things and the start of it is probably this week when you've seen these, this message here so that's lovely and that's our group one for our lovely earth signs uh, let's move on to group two and the fortune card for group two wow is a thief okay so thief here can be someone stealing time from you seeing it stealing time your energy but it could also literally mean that you are going to lose something this week as well so let's see how it ties in with the other cards in this group so your tarot card is the nine of water the nine of cups so your wish comes true and concerns fade away a love of life so how could this possibly tie in with the thief card well let's find out with 
your angel message. Listen to your intuition. So something's going to work out lovely for you here, but you have to listen to your intuition. Because if your intuition is telling you that something is off this week with somebody, it's probably correct. So maybe not to listen to this person because you are on the right path with the Nine of Cups here. Your wishes are about to come true. The Nine of Cups is the wish card. Maybe someone in your group doesn't like the fact that you are on a winning streak this week. I shall leave that there. That was our lovely group two. Say so this is for our earth signs, so Taurus, Capricorn and Virgo. And for those that chose group three, your fortune card is Privileged Lady. So Privileged Lady is exactly what it says. It's someone here who is well off. Um, this card to me is similar to the Nine of Pentacles card in the standard Rider Waite uh, tarot. It's a lady standing in the garden there. And she is established. She has established herself in the financial sphere. So let's see what other cards play with this. So the tarot message is the Six of Pentacles, the Six of Earth. So gifts of money, time or effort, new career opportunities and receiving a loan or paying off debts. So with this card here, the Privileged Lady, I would say that this is that there is new opportunities around in your career for you, if you're not in this position, to indeed get to this, to this position here which is an established financial position where you can afford the little luxuries in life. But there is an opportunity coming in in your career that could be coming in this week where you get to do that. But also financially, you could be paying off debts and becoming more financially stable over the, the coming weeks. And... Your angel message, wow, is abundance. Wow. So there is definitely more abundance coming into your life, which means you're able to pay off debts, you're able to pay off loans. And you're also able to give money. Uh, it could be gifts of money, time or effort. You could actually be gifting other people in your life and helping them out as well. Could also be winning the lottery here with this. But this, these are lovely cards here for monetary gain. Okay, guys, I hope you've enjoyed your readings. As I say, these are the quick picker card readings and their weekly readings. My in-depth um, monthly readings are coming every month. So look out for those. Um, and also, please do subscribe to the channel. Uh, as like I've said, it is free to do so. Um, and uh, everybody's welcome. So always believe in yourself. Follow your dreams and stay blessed.